Hey guys, what's up? In this video, I'm going to be explaining how you can jailbreak your iPhone 4, iPod Touch 4, iPhone 3GS, iPod Touch 3G on 4.1, as well as your iPad 3.2.2 using a tool called Green Poison that was finally released by the iPhone dev team yesterday. If you guys watched my previous video on Lime Rain that was released by Geohot, you know that it jailbroke all of these same devices on the same firmwares and it was released earlier than the iPhone dev teams. This green poison jailbreak re actually jailbreaks the exact same devices on the exact same firmwares. So if you are already jailbroken using Lime Rain, there really is no point to use green poison. There's no added benefits or anything. So don't do this if you're already jailbroken. I just figured I'd make a video because it was released and it was so hyped up. Um, again, this only works for Windows because, well, Windows and Linux, because unfortunately it has not been released to the Mac uh, world yet. I will have a video on both Lime Rain and Green Poison when they are released for Mac, but as of right now, this is just Windows and Linux, and along with that, guys, I'm on my Mac right now. I can't actually show you a live demo of this because I already am jailbroken using Lime Rain. But if you want to see what this essentially will look like, go ahead and check out the my previous video on Lime Rain. It shows you pretty much the same thing that's, that this is going to look like. But let's get to the guide because that's the point of this video. So I was searching long and wide for a guide on how to do this with pictures for you guys because I can't actually give you a live demo. And the best one that I found is from Redmond Pie, which will be in the description. I'll open it up for you here. And as you can see, the title says, Jailbreak iOS 4.1, iPhone 4, 3GS, iPod Touch 4G, iPad, uh, with Green Poison. The Chronic Dev team has released it, as I said before. And support for the iPod Touch 2G and the Apple TV, as well as Mac, will be released soon. So stay tuned for that. I'll probably have a guide on how to do that, too. But essentially, this is going to be the step-by-step step guide that Redmond Pi has given out. So this is essentially what it looks like once you jailbroke. Once you jailbreak, it has a loader icon and Cydia, and I'm going to be teaching you how to do that through their guide. If you do rely on an unlock, Redmond Pi uh, recommends do not update to iOS 4.1 because it will upgrade your baseband, which makes it impossible to unlock. So do not update if you rely on an unlock. Just wait for Ponage Tool or something else to come out that you definitely know you will be able to keep the unlock. But step one, guys. First, you got to download Green Poison from the link given below. So along with the Redmond Pi link in the description, this link to Green Poison will be in the description. And this is the website you download it from. It says Mac, Linux, and Windows. As you can see, if I click Mac, it just refreshes the page, and it doesn't actually download anything because it has not been released yet. But you can download it for Linux and for Windows. I downloaded it for Windows on my Windows PC um, just to test it out, but I didn't actually, I couldn't actually jailbreak. It wouldn't work because I was already jailbroken with Lime Rain. But download it for your uh, operating system. Link will be in the description. Step two. You're going to want to connect your iPhone or device via USB to your computer and you're going to want to click prepare to jailbreak as seen in the screenshot below. Before you actually do this, make sure you are updated to the latest version of iTunes and the latest firmware on your device unless you rely on an unlock. Once you have done that, download the program, open it up, and you can do this. If you plug in your device, Make sure you close out of iTunes and all open programs just before trying this to make it easier. So yeah, prepare. click prepare to jailbreak as seen in the screenshot right here um, when you are ready. Once you do that, it's going to give you a set of on-screen instructions. It's going to say, first off, press and hold the sleep button for two seconds. Then it's going to say, continue holding sleep and press and hold for 10 seconds. And then it's going to say release sleep and continue holding the home button for 15 seconds. Um, it's pretty simple, guys. It gives you the on-screen on instructions and tells you when to switch to the next step with the countdowns here on the side, as you can see. Um, and essentially, that's going to get your device in DFU mode. Once you do that, the program will actually pause itself and it will say you're ready to jailbreak. So all you have to do is click jailbreak, as you can see right here in the lower left of the screenshot. 
And once you do that, um, it, this little scroll bar will start scrolling up all the way to the other end. As you can see, it's scrolled all the way up here when it is done. And you will actually be officially, <coughs> excuse me, you will actually be officially jailbroken on 4.1 or 3.2.2. Um, and once you have done that, your home screen will actually look like this screenshot up here. You will have a loader icon and a Cydia icon. Um, in order to actually install Cydia, you have to first open up the loader. Um, so go ahead and open up loader once you are jailbroken. Um, as you can see here in step six, they say start loader found on the home screen. And all you're going to do is install Cydia. So you're going to click the little Cydia thing. And up, come, up will come a pop-up. You hit install Cydia. And it will download, as you can see in this picture. And it will install. And that is it. You are done, you are jailbroken, and you will have the Cydia icon on your home screen along with the loader icon. And other notes that the dev team actually mentioned is there is currently no way to unlock your iPhone on the latest baseband for 4.1. So if you do rely on an unlock, do not update. I can't stress that enough. Also, um, I personally wanted to let you guys know again that all of my personal links will be in the description as well as the download to Green Poison and my Lime Rain video as well as this Redmond Pie uh, link. Um, sorry about not giving you guys a live demo but I already am jailbroken with Lime Rain. Um, but if this helped you out in any way, please subscribe and please rate thumbs up. I will have the Mac guide out for Lime Rain and Green Poison when it is released. Also, I will probably have some jailbreak videos coming up soon in general on apps and the like. So go ahead and subscribe and please rate thumbs up again. Visit my links and uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Enjoy your jailbreak. Peace.